everybody. Happy Friday. It is I, your songwriting partner, your co-producer, and as always, your friend, Joe CB. And happy Friday, guys. And Friday is always our melody writing day. So tonight we're writing the melody based on the lyrics that I wrote for the Thursday class. Excuse me, for Picture This. Um, I called it Hurricane. This is what I called it, based on the picture that I gave you guys. Okay, so... Um, now, just remember, the melody of a song is the tune. It's not the lyrics. Lyrics are words. Melody is the tune. And um, just try to remember that all the time when you're, you know, whenever you're, because sometimes you guys will send me lyrics and say, oh, I wrote a melody. I'm like, that's not a melody. Those, those are lyrics. So just try to remember that. Lyrics are words. Melody is the tune. Okay. So, um, based on that photograph that I gave you guys, I looked at that picture and, you know, um, and tried to compose a melody. Now, what, you know, how do you compose a melody, right? Well, you know, there's lots of different ways. Some people do it with chords first, a track, like, you know, a producer will produce a track and then give it to an, a singer or an artist or a songwriter. And the, then that songwriter will sit down and try to come up with, a melody that works well with that selection of chords that they put together. And I do the same thing. I do the same thing. Well, first, what I'm going to do right now is I'm just going to, um, I'm going to say the words, okay? And then I'm going to show you how I actually started to think of melodies for it, okay? So my words are, every time... I get a little bit closer. I try to break through, but you say it's over. Your words hit me like a runaway train. The pain so strong, it's coming on like a hurricane. So the first thing I did when I was saying those words, I started saying those words like on repeat, right? Every time I get a little bit closer, try to break through, but you say it's over. Your words hit me like a runaway train. The pain so strong, it's coming on like a hurricane. I just thought that was kind of catchy. I liked, I liked the cadence of it. I liked the way it rolled, you know? So, and of course, because I'm not just a songwriter and a producer, I'm a singer too, so... Um, and I know my voice, I know my range, so I, I, I try to pick a range that I know is going to work well for my voice. And we might write the song, a girl might sing this, so a girl is going to have to, you know, for a girl with a high voice, she's going to have to go up a couple of steps, like a half, couple half steps, maybe one half step, maybe one whole step. Just bring the key up, modulate the key up, right? So, um... Or if it's a guy and he has a lower voice, you're going to have to bring it down for him if it's a lower timbral voice than my own, right? So I tend to like soaring melodies, melodies that kind of go up because that's where my voice sits anyway. So, and I know my voice well, so I try to, you know, um, accommodate, you know, I, I find a pitch that's good for my voice to showcase the melody, if that's... If you get that. Okay, so the first thing I heard when I started throwing this around was, um, was, um, I didn't even know what key it was. This is just what came out of my mouth. You know, I always kind of hear a melody in the back of my head, you know, it's not always developed. It's sort of like a blurry photograph. And then you have to make it clearer by organizing it in your mind, right? So, and like I said before, I say this every class, but Every melody is derived from a scale, from a scale, right? So you have major scales, minor scales, harmonic minor scales, Phrygian scales, um, you know, all kinds um, of different scales and modes, uh, pentatonic scale, like the blues scale, the chromatic scale, you know, just going down chromatically. Um, so every melody that you've ever heard in your life was derived from a scale, now, in a scale, normally you just go up and down. Now, we don't do that with a melody. We pick those random notes out of a melody to create what we want to hear, right? So, let's say we're doing... 
that's a that's a um, that's C major, and that's a C major scale. Right, so um, we wouldn't we if we wrote uh, a song that was in C major, we wouldn't just sing that scale up and down. We'd choose notes out of it. Let's say, let's see. There's only three notes right there. Right? Let's say we go. Where we go? Where we go? Um, where we go? So whatever order you put it in, that's going to be. If you only have three notes. Right, so you're going. You can go one, two, three. You can go one, three, two. You can go two, three, one. You know, I hope I'm not confusing you. You just take instead of just going straight up, ascending, descending scale. You're picking notes that are in that scale, especially based on the chords. Whatever you know, whatever song the chord progression is in a song, then you try to come up with that. I'm giving you more of the science tonight, but I, I am going to show you how I came up with this melody, okay? So, um, let me see. Um, right, so, um, the first thing I heard, I didn't even play the piano yet. I just went, every time I get a little bit closer. So, then I grab my guitar. Sometimes I grab my guitar because it just, you know, I go, um... I like that. Every time I get a little bit closer, every time I get a little bit closer, I try to be too much to say it's over. I like that. Every time I get a little bit closer, I try to be too much to say it's over. Right? And it, I, you know, it took me a while to come up with that idea, right? It, it didn't just pop out of my head. But I heard the melody first, but but I know chords, so like I knew what chords were gonna work with that melody. So I'm, every time I get a little bit closer, I'm trying to break through, but you say it's over, right? Um, then I I wanted to go to something a little different in the second half of this, right? So I went every time I get a little bit closer, I'm trying to break through, but you say it's over, you words hit me. Like a runaway train, the pain so strong's coming on like a hurricane. So, you know, I'm going right every time I get a little bit closer, trying to make do when you say it's over. Your words hit me like a runaway train, the pain so strong's coming on like a hurricane. Every time I get a little bit closer, trying to break through, but you say it's over. Your words hit me like a runaway train, the pain. So I was just, you know, I mean, of course, it took me a lot longer than just that, right? So let me see what key that is, All right? So, so we're going. So it's, um. That's the melody, but if that if I'm if I'm going okay. so. so it's actually A minor. That's an A minor scale, so But of course, I'm not just singing straight up and down A minor. You know, I'm, I'm taking, choosing notes out of that scale to create that melody. So it's, you know, I just like that chord too. I was like, every time I get a little bit closer, I try to make do what you say it's over. You worked in me like a runaway train. Strong, it's coming on like a hurricane. 
I just thought that was kind of pretty. Um, on the demo, I don't even play the guitar. I just sing to the piano and the bass. So, um, so yeah, that and that, like I said, that melody is derived from the A minor scale. That's an A minor scale. So, um, so there you have it. That's like the whole thing, but. You know, and also, I always usually try to come up with a melody based on the mood of that picture. So that that also helps me kind of define what it's going to sound like in a way. You know, the, between the words and the image, it sort of already paints a picture for me. And then I find the direction and the implication of the melody based on the photograph. So... That's how I came up with this. So right now I'm going to do the. Um, I want to um, right now I'm going to play you the little demo. So here's the demo. Every time I get a little bit closer, trying to break through, but you say it's over. Your words hit me like a runaway train. The pain so strong is coming on like a hurricane. Every time I get a little bit closer, trying to break through, but you say it's over. Your words hit me like a runaway train. The pain so strong is coming on like a hurricane. The pain so strong is coming on like a hurricane. Pain so strong coming on like a hurricane. Mm. The pain so strong coming on like a hurricane. The pain so strong coming on like a hurricane. And that's it, guys. That's the whole thing. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. That is all the time we have for tonight. This is your songwriting partner, your co-producer, and as always, your friend Joe CB signing off. Have a great weekend. I love you guys, and I will see you on Monday. Peace.